Barbecue wings are an awesome appetizer. Crispy inside and sweet and sticky on the outside. It is perfect for game day or entertaining at home. Hi friends, welcome to The Practical Housewife where I will be helping you to transform your meals into a luxurious experience your family and friends can enjoy. I am your favorite housewife and host, Yelan Wallace. Let's get started. To make our honey barbecue sauce, we will need honey, browning, Old Bay seasoning, or your favorite all-purpose seasoning, chicken wings, barbecue sauce, garlic powder, onion powder, and chili. To begin making our honey barbecue wings, first we are going to preheat our oven to 425 degrees. And I have already done that. I've also gone ahead and separated my whole wings into drums and flats. We all have our favorites. Some people love their drums and some love their flats. I in particular love my flats. To season our wings, I'm first going to go in and be adding some olive oil to my wings and you want to add a good amount. Go ahead and I'm going to give this a nice rub. Next I'm going to go in and add some garlic, some garlic powder. some onion powder, a little bit of chili, cayenne pepper, and I will be using some Old Bay seasoning and some salt. Now that I have seasoned my chicken, I will go in and give it a nice rub. Ensuring that all the wings have a nice coat of seasoning on it. There you have it. This is what it looks like. Now we are going to work on our flour. Now that we are all done with our chicken, I will set this aside and now we are going to be working on our batter. So for our dry batter, we're going to be adding one cup of flour and adding three seasonings of my choice to it because this is what I like. I'll be adding chili, garlic powder, and cayenne pepper. A few of the seasonings that we added to the chicken. cup of flour, some chili powder, I like my barbecue sauce, a little bit spicy, some cayenne pepper, Oops. and garlic. If it's one thing that I love to add when I am cooking, it's garlic. Garlic powder, fresh garlic, it just makes the food taste amazing. So I am now mixing the flour to ensure that it is well seasoned and all I'm going to do is to add this to our chicken wings. So to our chicken wings we are going to be adding the flour. go in and give it a nice rub you can just tell this is going to be so good it's going to be seasoned to the bone and as you can see the wings have 
taken up the flour because of the oil, which is what we want. We are not deep frying, but we want to get a nice crispy wing to eat. So our wings are now done and I will be adding our wings to a lined baking sheet and I lined mine with parchment paper to ensure that it doesn't stick, especially when we add our barbecue sauce towards the end. You want to go ahead and shake off the excess flour. are the exact amount <laughs> to fit this tray so it is now time to add our wings to the oven and we are going to be cooking our wings for 45 minutes and we will be flipping it halfway to ensure that both sides get nice, nice and crisp. Now that our chicken is in the oven, it is now time to work on our sauce. First, I'll be adding some barbecue sauce. For barbecue sauce, I will be adding some honey. And this is honey barbecue wings, so I like to add raw honey to it. I'll be adding some browning and seasoning sauce just to add a little bit of color. Just a little bit. And then I will be adding some red pepper flakes because as I said I like my barbecue wings a little bit spicy you can skip if you don't like spice you can skip the chili the cayenne pepper and the pepper flakes it will still taste amazing so and to marry the flavors together I'll add a pinch of salt so today I will be serving my wings with some carrot sticks. So we'll go ahead and prepare that. So to prepare my carrot sticks, not strips, <laughs> to prepare my carrot sticks, I will be first cleaning my carrot by peeling it using my vegetable peeler and then I will go in and cut equal strips First, I will cut this in half, lay it on the flat side, and I will get, I will cut three. Nice and thick. The other half, flat side down, cut in threes. Flat side down, cut in three equal parts. Have or carrot sticks. To garnish our wings today, I will be using some freshly chopped parsley. You can chop these yourself or 
You can also purchase these. You can also purchase these. They are available in bottle form, semi-dry, but I like to use fresh parsley rather than the flakes and I'm not cutting it too fine. So this will be our garnish just to, you know me, to add a little razzle dazzle to our wings once it is done. It is now time to flip our wings. This smells so good. These are nice flip. that's why I love using the parchment paper because it doesn't stick to the pan and it's also easier to clean it back in the oven to finish cooking and we are looking for it to be fall off the bone perfect our wings are now done and it is time to remove them from the oven Now that our wings are done, we will be adding it to our sauce. So what I will do is I will dip the wing, give it a nice turn, and then place it back into the baking tray. to be placing our wings back into the oven for eight to ten minutes until it has caramelized and then we are done our wings is now whew, the heat it's now done So to plate our wings today, we are using this rectangular shaped 
um, stoneware plate and I thought this would be perfect for our wings and what I'm going to do I'm going to be stacking our wings and then once I'm done stacking I will go ahead and garnish have two more wings this looks so good now that we have added our wings to the plate I will go ahead and add my carrot sticks and I'll be adding it towards the front to the plates I will also be adding a pop of color to lemon slices and to finish it off a sprinkle of fresh cut parsley not too much and there you have it our wings is done and there we have it friends our crispy sweet and sticky wings are done I truly believe that you are more than capable of making this dish and impressing your family and friends. If you found this video helpful, entertaining, or both, please let me know by liking this video and commenting sticky wings. See you next time.